Hello, welcome to LabVIEW Pro. In this video, we'll learn about how to write a file into the initialization or .ini file in LabVIEW. In the front panel, we have only one cluster control with the name, string data type, age, the numeric control, and the gender as the enum control. And in the background, we can see the detail.inr file. As you can see, it's currently empty. Now what we have to do is, we have to convert and write the file into the .inr file. So just like in the .csv file, we have the unbundled by name. In this case, we have to use the configuration file vi palette. And in this case, we need only three different vi's. The initialization, close reference, and the write keys. Let's uh, arrange them properly. Since we have three different data types in the cluster, we require three keys. Keys are basically the labels that are required in the .ina file to reference the data that is being stored in the file. So let's connect the reference that has been created by the initialization vi of the configuration file and the error cluster to aid the data flow and now what we have to do is first of all is the name age and gender so what it basically does is Convert that one, convert into the string, and send it into the first right key. Now, similarly, the age. And note that uh, the right key and read key can operate on a string, uh, integer values, boolean, and numeric values, and everything, but it cannot operate on the enum. Now, create constant that will be the key name. So the first key name is the gender. Similarly, uh, let's copy paste that one. So we have to write the other keys. Uh, apparently, that will be the age and name. Okay, arrange it properly. Now, one more thing is required in .ina file. There are different sections of the file that are called sections so in this case the whole three data types belongs to the same section and we name it details now everything is done and never forget to close the .ina file reference if you forget to do that the code won't be able to save the changes made in the .ina file now let's test it uh, change the values in the personal detail control cluster and now if we run it, and if you double click and open it, as you can see, we see details in the section, and we have three keys allocated over there that stores the different types of data types. 